The rhythmic tapping of claws echoed through the abandoned subway tunnel. Millie, a stray cat with a torn ear, stalked a particularly plump rat. This was her territory, her domain, and tonight's dinner was invading it. Just as Millie pounced, a guttural growl froze her mid-leap. A pair of glowing eyes emerged from the darkness, followed by a hulking figure unlike anything Millie had ever seen. It was vaguely canine, but far larger, with matted fur and bioluminescent markings. Terror locked Millie's legs. This wasn't a beast of the city, this was something else entirely. But to Millie's surprise, the creature didn't attack. Instead, it nudged the stunned rat towards her with its snout. A guttural rumble, almost a purr, emanated from its throat. Millie, bewildered but not foolish, cautiously snatched the offering and retreated. As she scurried back into the shadows, she glanced back. The creature was gone, leaving only an eerie silence in its wake. The encounter unsettled her, but a strange warmth bloomed in her chest. The following nights, the creature returned, leaving a small offering in its wake. A particularly juicy worm, a plump beetle, each a silent gesture of kindness. One moonlit night under the flickering lights, the creature reappeared. This time, an inexplicable energy surged through Millie. Her fur prickled, bones rearranged, and with a yelp, she found herself standing upright, her feline form replaced by a slender woman with glowing teal eyes. Across from her stood a young man, impossibly handsome, his eyes mirroring her own eerie glow. This spectral guardian, bound to the tunnels, looked at her with hesitant hope. He spoke, his voice a melodic vibration in her mind, not through her ears. Thank you, he said, for accepting my gifts, for seeing me. Millie, now human again, felt a rush of emotions, gratitude, surprise, but most of all a burgeoning affection for this lonely spirit. It's not just the gifts, she replied, her voice a mental echo in the darkness. You offer companionship, a connection that transcends everything. The handsome wraith smiled, a gesture that sent a shiver of warmth down Millie's spine. Perhaps, she thought, this wasn't just a friendship, but the beginning of something more extraordinary. A love story blooming in the forgotten corners of the world, between a stray with a secret and a spectral guardian yearning for connection. They were different, yes, but in the flickering light of the tunnels they found solace and a love that defied the boundaries of life and death.